everyone, this is Lorraine and um, yeah, I'm back with another video for this year <laughs> and um, today I'm going to be sharing with you about mistakes I've made while self-publishing um, yeah, so of course everyone makes mistakes um, so I'm going to be sharing with you them and hopefully you won't make the same ones now, the first book that I've ever self-published was back when I was 21 years old, 20, 21. And um, yeah, you know, at that age, you tend to do a lot of mm, not that great, you know, mistake. I mean, you sure will make some mistakes, right? So, um, okay, my first book is called Manchi is and Everything. And um, back then, Obviously, I was clueless about the whole process. Um, I did get like a consultant editor to help me out, and yeah, because I'm not a very detailed person, I tend to be kind of like the big picture kind of person. So, so yeah, this happened. Uh, this is the first print. Dun, dun, dun. Munchy is an everything. <laughs> that was what happened. Munchy is an everything. <gasps> and this like only happened. I mean, I only noticed this mistake like after I got my I don't know three thousand copies of, of this book. Yeah, it was it was like whoa and um yeah I didn't even realize it until much. And then someone pointed out to me that, you know, hey, your cover, your cover is totally wrong, you know. Ugh, it's horrible. Anyway, I did, I did like ask my, uh, my consultant guy, like, hey, what's going on? Like, what is this about? And then he did give me back like some money, but still it's like the damage is done and paper has been wasted. But anyway, anyway. It's a learning experience and um, yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's a learning experience and uh, hopefully you guys don't do not do this, Don't doesn't happen to you and always proofread and proofread and, and check and check and check again. Um, yeah, that was mistake number one. Okay, mistake number two was uh, also it happened when I was doing Manchi and everything. Uh, back then, I did get a different artist to um, help me out. Now, she was like a friend of a friend, you know, that kind of thing. And uh, back then, being like 20 years old, I always thought that, oh, okay, uh, she'll do it for me for free, you know? <laughs> well, thinking back, of course, obviously, she wasn't going to do it for me for free. I mean, she might, but it's just that we did not really... Uh, there were no terms and conditions that were stated, you know. She didn't say anything, I didn't say anything. We both assumed different things. Anyway, <laughs> so what happened was that uh, after that, yeah, she was like, she expected like, I don't know, 20% of book sales or something or, yeah, which is like, that's, that's, that's too much. I mean, I don't even know how many books I'm gonna, you know, and so there was like, I was like brought to, to like small claims court and we finally like settled an agreement but obviously the friendship was like totally and um, yeah so nowadays it's always important like especially when you're doing self-publishing and you are probably approaching uh, many freelancers, friends or friends to help you do things to always state down how much are they gonna are they expecting for your services and how much are you willing to pay for the services? Yeah, so that was mistake number two. Uh, mistake number three, I guess was like after the whole like munchie isn't everything thingy and I was like super tired of the whole process and I just like okay, let me just write another book and let me just self-publish it out and um, yeah, so that's what I did. But the thing was that I, I guess I was so tired by then and, and I was just like uh, <laughs> yeah, I was just like so jaded by the whole thing and and I didn't do any publicity for the second book I was like just like just put it in the shelves 
just leave it there <laughs> and that's it obviously no one is gonna buy it right I mean no one who are not your friends or people that you know <laughs> yeah so second book didn't do very well even though obviously I was more cautious in a lot of my previous mistakes but I just didn't really push it enough I didn't really like you know do a lot of publicity for it <laughs> so yeah these are three things which uh, Lorraine three mistakes that Lorraine have done hopefully you will not you will not do them as well anyway um, so as a special uh, offer promotion thing I'm gonna be giving away yeah Munchie isn't everything <laughs> Munchie isn't everything uh, free yeah free to everyone you know to anyone all you have to do is email um, email your details you know details are like more at the bottom of the screen uh, email your yeah, like your contact details your shipping details your mailing details and I will mail a copy to you absolutely free <laughs> yeah and another thing that's going for free uh, pop rock love I'm putting it up again um, on uh, it's gonna be free on Amazon Kindle for I think three days three four days check out the details below as well so these are the mistakes I made hopefully <laughs> Hopefully you will not, you know, do them as well. Uh, writing, I guess self-publishing, there's a lot of things that you have to handle as opposed to just being a writer. And uh, details are very important. I'm very bad at details, but details are really important. And uh, no matter what, I mean mistakes are a way to learn, you know? So don't get too discouraged by them. Anyway, hope this was uh, useful for you guys. Hope to see you again. Bye!